Hello everyone, this is Dreadnought. Today we're going to talk about gearing. There's a rumor that I use my alt, a Demon Hunter 2 gear, and that rumor is true. And so if you like the Barbarian and you like the Demon Hunter, then this is the video for you. If you have a Barbarian and you're having some trouble grind, uh, grinding Act 3 Inferno, then this is also good for you. Um, the some of the bosses in Inferno I can take down a lot faster with my Demon Hunter even though she is not as geared as my Barbarian. So if you look at my stats right now I have very low defense and actually all of my defense is for not on this fight because I get one shot by everything. So you will notice during this fight I never get hit which isn't too hard on this fight. It's a pretty easy kite fight. And it takes around four minutes to do this run as long as you don't get one shot and so I can do this about 15 times in an hour I might do this for an hour or two a day it gets pretty tiring but this is a decent way to grind out some of the better gear most of the time you're not gonna get anything worthwhile but every once in a while you're gonna get one of those million gold pieces that makes this worth it like I said, the gear on my Demon Hunter isn't awesome. I sold a weapon I found with my Barbarian for 2.5 million on the auction house and used that money to gear the, my Demon Hunter. So it's not horrible gear, obviously, but it is it is not Rockstar Baller gear that, that you need to do these runs. I have about 250 resist all, but it's very unnecessary because, like I said, I get one shot by everything. I have 14,000 life, which is low, but I get one shot by everything, so it's more than I actually need. So focus on damage, and that doesn't just mean a big hitting weapon in decks. For Demon Hunter, it's nice to stack crit hit chance, crit hit damage, decent DPS on your weapon, and decks. Uh, and I'm going to talk a little bit about how to use the AH to get those stats. So crit hit chance, crit hit damage, attack speed, dex, and DPS on your weapon. And don't expect to go to the AH and spend 15 minutes with a pocket full of gold and find all those things. It, I know I'm making it sound like it's a, an easy process, but it takes a lot of patience and waiting and bidding and time on the AH. But gearing is end game progression, and AH is gearing. So if you spend five hours grinding out a million gold and then spend 15 minutes on the AH and you make some bad purchases, then you misspent five hours grinding gold. Uh, if you're not, if you're just playing for fun and you don't really care about this stuff, then my video is not going to help you out that much. I'm all, I'm all about playing for fun, but if you want to play for efficiency also, then spend a little bit more time on the AH and throw in a couple of these boss grinds. The I'm at around 73% magic find right now, which isn't a lot, but it's about the same as a full Nephilim stack. And so that saves me a lot of times. Uh, time I don't have to go out and try and grind 5 elites to get a full Nephilim stack, which I couldn't do on my Demon Hunter anyway since she's way too squishy and not nearly geared enough for Act 3 Inferno, except for this boss. So, quick grind, a little bit of gear, sometimes I get a yellow that sells for a lot, sometimes I don't, but that's the beautiful thing about these Demon Hunter runs, is they only take about four minutes, so leave, join back, do it again. I know a lot of you are going to want to see the gear that I'm rolling with, and a lot of you will notice that this isn't top shelf gear, this is just below top shelf gear. It's not cheap, but it's not too expensive either to find this type of gear. I'm going to show you real quick what I do on the auction house to make sure that I'm getting my money's worth. All right, there are key pieces of gear. The first key piece is your weapon. I spend about a million on my weapon, but I spent I take a long time looking for my weapon. Um, so with your weapon, you mainly want uh, DPS as the number one focus. With a uh, Demon Hunter, if you're stacking crit hit chance, though, it's also really nice to have crit hit damage on there. So if you can get a socket and a strong 
emerald in there, then you're going to be on your way. So let's look real quick at a type of search I do. I do 100,000 max buyout searches for all of my gear except for my rings, amulet, and gloves. Uh, those are key pieces and quiver. Sorry, those I do 200,000 max buyout searches and my weapon 1 million max buyout. So I'm just going to walk through real quick how I do a search. So let's look for gloves. Like I said, for gloves, we're going to do 200,000 max buyout. This isn't the same for everyone. If your gloves are already really nice, then you're, it's going to be hard to find an upgrade for 200,000. But start with your weakest piece of gear and work your way up from there. So let's go gloves. And the key stats we're looking for on gloves are crit hit chance and attack speed. And this is not the same for all classes. This is for demon hunter. Squishy Demon Hunter specifically for grinding gear uh, and for me grinding gear for my melee class. So we'll do minimum level 55. Alright, so we have five pages at least of gloves that have crit hit chance and attack speed. And so this is not narrow enough. So we're going to make a little bit more stipulation on this. Alright, two pages, more like one page, is a decent amount. So then we're going to sort this by buyout. And look at that. What an amazing... This is really underpriced. I should just buy this right now and resell, but I'm not going to because I'm making a video. One day, 11 hour. Look for those really quick, too. Scroll through because those are the ones that are likely to be posted for way too little. This is this should be closer to 150,000, not 20,000, because it has 6.5% crit, 15% attack speed, and some other garbage on there. But... So do these searches. If I go through this whole list and I don't see anything that really strikes me as super awesome for my money, which is going to happen all the time, change up your search a little bit. Let's get rid of that 6 and change to dex. And awesome. Two more pages I can go through. Sort again by buyout. And go through again. And if you change your mind, you like something on the, the first search you did, go back to that. But spend some time on the auction house. Don't don't come in and do blanket searches without any stipulations with 55 pages worth of stuff trying to find the perfect piece make specific searches that get you down to around one or two pages search by buyout look at the one day 11 hour first go through if, if you're not positive that you're finding a good deal for your money don't buy right away so change up your search a little bit do it again and if you're really not finding anything change up what you're looking for because the game is all about gear, and if you're grinding money really fast, but you're not spending it wisely, then you're not using your time well. If you have any questions on running Demon Hunters, or how to grind out your gear by gear a little more quickly, go ahead and post in the comments. If you saw, I'm not awesome with the Demon Hunter, so if you saw a flaw in my builds, I'd appreciate it if you pointed it out and tell me how I could do these runs a little faster. Hopefully this was helpful. Subscribe for the next tips and strats that come out, and I appreciate all the likes that you're throwing my way.